The second Lifetime Achievement Award goes to our esteemed colleague, Dr. Anthony DeQueer. Tony, please join me on stage. Dr. DeQueer has a music therapy career spanning four decades. He has, been an he has been active as a vocalist, clinician, teacher, researcher, and advocate for the profession. He served as president of the National Association for Music Therapy from 1986 to 1988, providing vital leadership at a time of transition. The association had moved from Lawrence, Kansas to Washington, D.C. in 1982 an amazing feat fueled by the leaders and members' vision for better legislative opportunities in close proximity to Capitol Hill. During his term as president-elect, Tony and the board of directors made courageous decision, decisions which preserved the financial integrity of the association. Dr. DeQueer also served NAMT and AMTA as an assembly delegate, research committee member, and Journal of Music Therapy consulting editor. He has, a, he has a long established research, publication, and national presentation record. In addition to his work as a music therapy clini clinician in mental health, he has taught in the music therapy program at Loyola University in New Orleans since 1974, influencing the education of hundreds of music therapy students. Tony has been the associate dean of the College of Music and Fine Arts since 1990, twice serving as interim dean. He is known to his Loyola University colleagues and students as a gentle humanitarian who inspires those around him. Congratulations, Tony. Thank you. Now let me hold this for you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Madam President, members of the board, my esteemed colleagues. I want you to know that one cannot reach lifetime achievement with without, as Ruth said, standing on the shoulders of many, many people. And indeed, I have, uh, over these many 40 years, stood on many, many shoulders. And I've also had a very, very strong rock to lean upon. This woman has put up with, with me for the last 40 years. Uh, all of my antics and false starts and all kinds of other weird ideas, I guess. And I want to thank my wife of 42 years, Ms. Sarah DeQueer, for all of our help. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> it has been a blast. And, and, as, as <laughs> and as Madam Chair will tell you, Back in the day, back in the 80s, indeed, we fought many battles. Oh, my word, the battle to move to Washington, the establishment of music therapy perspective, the, the, the combination or the combining of the associations. Boy, those were battles, those were, those were fights. But what I see here this evening is a spirit among you folks, you young people, uh, that we once had, but uh, uh, that is... <laughs> We were there. I remember my wife said, no, you're, you're looking at those kids, right? You were there. Remember that, right? Yeah, I was there. And we had the fight. I challenge you all, with all the spirit, all of the energy that I see here tonight to get involved. There are new battles. There are new frontiers to conquer. Get involved. Let the membership, let your leadership know that, hey, I'm here and I have an opinion. That's the best you can do for them. Give them your opinion. Give them your support. Be there. And as Carol Bidcon, an old, old dear friend of mine said, risk it. Take a shot. Thank you. Thank you very much from the bottom of my heart. <laughs>